I'm almost finished with the lights, Barbie. It's looking really, really good. Hurry up, Skipper. You're really heavy. Whoa! Ouch. I'm sorry, Skipper. It's okay. Ugh! Don't you think all the decorations are a little bit scary for the party? We're gonna have some toddlers here, you know? Not at all. The decorations are super cool for Halloween, Barbie. Well, don't you think it's too much? We're inviting Chelsea's little friends, Elsa and Anna's daughters. It's kind of spooky. Wow, this looks so cool. Yeah, it looks amazing. You don't think it's too much, you guys? Nope, it looks awesome. <laughs> I like the skeleton. I already have the Halloween spirit. I put a fake tattoo on my forehead. It's a spooky spider. Sometimes I don't know how we're related. Weird. Huh? I thought it was cool. It must be Ken. Hey guys, how am I supposed to get through with all these ew, yucky spider webs? Ugh. Whoa, these decorations are really cool. Ow, I just hit my head. Anyway, I brought some chocolate eggs. I mean, chocolate eyes. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? They're like creepy zombie eyes, but they're made of chocolate. Cool. Where do you want me to put them? Uh, somewhere over there. Okay. Ah, oh, great. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're decorating Barbie's dollhouse into a scary Halloween haunted house. And I got all these really cool decorations from the dollar store. We have some little spider webs, skeletons, lights, pumpkins, googly chocolate eyes, and more. I think it's going to be really, really fun and the perfect place for Barbie and her friends to have a Halloween costume party. I'm going to start putting spider webs in the house and I'm going to use some tape to glue it down and it's going to look super cool. I found these skeleton garlands from the dollar store and we're going to be hanging them up randomly in the house, one in the entrance and one by the door. And I almost forgot to put spiders on the spider webs. Now I found these little LED light set. This is a purple light and there's also an orange version. These are also from the dollar store. And they're battery operated so these are perfect for the dollhouse and they're pretty small so these are going to make the house look really cool. I also found this wobbly head jack-o'-lantern and you can just put that anywhere in the front of the house or just on the corner over here. Now I'm going to turn off the lights so we can see the purple lights a little better. Wow, this looks super cool. The perfect lighting for a Halloween party. Now I want to try out the orange ones. Pop the batteries on and these are also super cool. I love how it came out. And I also found these little lights with jack-o'-lanterns and these have an orange light as well. I'm going to decorate this little side table here. Making it look like a little graveyard. Put in some spider webs. Perfect. I have some more. These are from Michaels. <laughs> and this guy is just too funny. I'm taking some black fabric. Actually, this is a black sock. And I'm going to cut it in half and make it into a tablecloth for the Barbie table. We want it to look really worn out. So I'm going to be taping that. And we're going to be putting some Halloween treats here. I found this little ghost decoration as well. And I thought it looks really cool. I'm adding some glitter jars. This is black glitter. Just looks kind of mysterious. And this purple one as well. I have some black slime I found at the dollar store. 
And I'm not sure what it's gonna be yet, maybe some punch for the dolls, but I just thought it was really cool and slimy and wiggly. So it could be like a punch bowl, that's pretty cool. Maybe like a black cherry punch for the party. Okay guys, all the decorations are ready. Now let's see how it looks in the dark. Ken, turn off the lights please. Thank you. And now we have a spooky haunted house. Guys, it's time to put on our costumes. The party will be starting soon. <laughs> The first costume is going to be for Skipper. She is dressing up as Miraculous Ladybug because she is the coolest superhero right now. And this outfit fits her perfectly. Now all we need is a mask. And I'm going to be taking some red fabric. I cut out little holes for her eyes. And with a little marker, I'm going to be making the black dots. Just I'm going to make sure that it fits her. It doesn't have to be perfect, but it's just going to look really, really fun. And I'm going to just measure it again, make sure that her eyes are on the right place. I'm going to use a black Sharpie to add the little dots, the little black circles. And bam! She has a perfect Miraculous Ladybug costume. Tell me in the comments what you think about Skipper's Miraculous Ladybug Halloween costume. I'm so ready to have this Halloween party. Tiki! Spots on! <laughs> uh, too much? Okay, sorry. Now it's time for Stacy, and she is gonna be dressing up as Apple White from Ever After High. And this outfit fits her perfectly. Ken will be dressing up as Wolverine, and I got this outfit off Amazon. And for Barbie, I got this really adorable Halloween witch doll for Halloween party Barbie and she's looking so cute she's got a little witch hat a necklace this little witch outfit I love the pink highlights and her just has like some spiderweb designs and she has this beautiful black necklace and really cool boots now for Chelsea I'm dressing her up as a little princess this is an outfit I also got online, and it has a little pink princess hat as well. And she's a perfect little princess for this Halloween party. Now I'm taking this little pumpkin and some foam strips, gluing it on to make it look like a jack-o'-lantern bucket so Chelsea can go trick-or-treating with her friends. Yep, looks pretty good. Well guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. I had so much fun decorating Barbie's house for Halloween. Let me know down in the comments if you want to see the Halloween party and what characters you want to come. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye bye for now.